This first week of the new year, an inspiring story that you can change for the better. An Albuquerque woman who grew up under the roughest of circumstances and did three stints in prison has overcome the odds, even graduating from UNM. Tonight, her total transformation. The card you're dealt with in life isn't always a win-win. Sometimes the deck is stacked against the most precious and innocent. I was born right here in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Jenny Noriega had a hard knock life from her first breath. I really never knew that life for me was any different than any other kid. Born to an alcoholic mother and abandoned, Jenny was sent to live with her father in a van in California. He was very abusive and I lived in fear. She was molested at age five and quit school in the seventh grade. I took my first hit of crack cocaine when I was 11 years old, right here on Central. Drugs, alcohol, and crime consumed her life. By the time I was on 16, I was on New Mexico's Most Wanted. Um, by the time I was 19, I had been arrested 24 times as a juvenile. Jenny did three years of hard time in grants for battery. She started using and selling dope again after prison. My addiction got really bad. In my heart of hearts, I knew that there was a different life. For me, it was like m the depths of my soul wanted to be clean. Jenny had been addicted and pregnant. She had her ups and downs, her encounters with faith, but one day she had enough. I prayed like I've never prayed before, ever. And I cried like somebody had died. And I was weeping sorrowfully from the depths of my soul. And I promise you, that day, March the 6th, 2005, I stood up and I was completely delivered from a 19-year drug addiction like that. It's a story of redemption. Jenny is now a pastor at ABQ Central Sandia Church of the Nazarene. Many of you have had a combination of good and bad events in your life. The good events have taken over. Jenny is sober, has a strong family, graduated from CNM in social work, and now UNM with psychology and Africana studies. Here I sit, you know, um, ready to start my master's. Her ministry works the streets, the same streets she left. That's the hope in which I live for, is seeing lives change. From darkness, there can be a beacon of light. Now 41, Jenny estimates she spent almost a decade locked up, but she tells her story of triumph now as a pastor and motivational speaker.